Hey guys, so I'm just going to show you really quick how to do the copy compress method for sharing code with each other. Um, some of you saw Caleb uploaded his homework where he could just, uh, there's a little block of code and he copy pasted it and it suddenly appeared in Max. And it's really cool and it's actually really simple. Um, so this is just all the code I had at the end of the last tutorial right in front of me. And if I unlock the patch, I can just do Command A and select all. And you can see that everything in the patch is just selected. Um, and if I go up to edit, right next to copy, there's no hotkey for it. It just says copy compressed. And if I just do that, um, then essentially, if I just bring up like a text edit right here. And I just do command V or paste into it. We get this kind of like inscrutable random hash of text and whatnot that says pre code, code pre, and Max 5 patcher. Um, the Max 5 thing, it doesn't mean anything. I think they just made this back in Max 5 and they've never bothered to update that part of it. It'll still work fine. They'll still do it as Max 7. Um, but now, if I get rid of this, like I don't save it. Oh no, what have I done? But I could send this to you as um, just this part of code. And now if I just copy that, and you want, you want to get all of it. You can basically go from that pre uh, part right here to the um, backslash pre and just copy that. And then you see, need to say, um, or if I need to get max open here, I go max file new from clipboard. And it'll literally open up the whole patch for you. Uh, and it's a little bit like, um, it's like any other patch you open now. It's not going to save the values here or anything. But it's just a nice, simple way for us to share code with each other through, um, uh, what you may call, through email or whatnot. I've already had a few of you send me patches this way. Uh, if you go to the Cycling74 website, yeah, right there. A lot of people share code this way. I don't think you can, it's harder to upload files in this, but I bet if I just, okay, like sharing, a lot of people that share patches, they put that in the title of it. And you can see it actually, actually did that right here. It says pasted match patch, to click to expand. And I can just copy paste that part right here and go new from clipboard. And now they have an example of their code that they made that I can mess around with. And that's just kind of a convention that uh, for how people share stuff on the forums and whatnot. On our GitHub repo, I'm just putting the whole patches up there. Um, it's easier for me. It, it, you can't really, like, if I save this file and then I need to make adjustments to the file and upload it here, uh, it's easier to do that with the actual max patch. And that's totally fine, too. Each of these max patches is, like, 770 kilobytes, if anything. So they're still not very like resource intensive or resource heavy, um, but that's just a really quick way to share code with each other. You could even text it to each other, and if you have me high message on your computer and stuff, you could copy it from there and go into Max. Um, so yeah, like I said, just co uh, Command A to copy all, copy compressed, and then new from clipboard, and you'll just be able to make a copy of any Max patch. So have fun with that.